Hey, it's me, your old friend Sonic the Hedgehog. All right, Radical. Man, we sure have had some great adventures together over the years, haven't we? Remember that time we went to Green Hill Zone and stopped the evil Dr. Eggman? Oh, so cool. Now hold on a second, what are you saying? You don't recognize me? Well, I have been working out. What's that you're saying? Are you telling me that you think I ate the original Sonic the Hedgehog? And then wore his skin as a disguise to fool you? To make you drop your guard so I could eat you too? <laughs> you're being, you're being totally uncool right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, come on, man. Don't be like that. Hey, we're friends, right, buddy? Let me in. Come on, man. Let me into the house. I'm not. I'm not screwing around with you anymore. Let me in the. Let me in the house. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in right now. Let me in. Let me in. Confound it. Where is that blasted hedgehog? I'm right here, Eggman. Are you serious about settling things right here, right now? Look directly into my realistic eyes, Sonic. I am absolutely serious about settling things right here and now. Now, hand over that Chaosium Emerald. I guess you heard this round, Eggman. Go ahead and reach into my mouth and take the Chaosium Emerald. Ha! Ah, a simple task for a genius such as myself. Just car carefully, slowly reach my sensitive fingers into your gaping maw, Sonic. Just one second. Steady. Slowly. Steady. <laughs> what the? Hey, it's me, your old friend, Movie Sonic. Radical, how are you doing, buddy? Hey, man, are you home? Hey, come on, man. A anyone home? Time to let me in. Hey, that's weird. Looks like the door is locked. You unlock it for me, buddy? Hey, come on. We're friends, aren't we? We go way back. Remember when we... Went to Green Hill Zone together, and then we went to Chemical Casino Zone. <laughs> Hello! Well, hi. You know what? If that's, you know, the way you're going to be, maybe I don't want to be friends with you anymore. I'm, I'm out of here. Not available now. Please leave your name and phone number after the beep. Hello, it's me, Movie Sonic. Hey, listen, just wanted to let you know I'm so sorry for those mean things I said to you. I, I didn't mean any of it. To me, we're still best friends. So if you could.
just let me in, you know, just let me in, let me in, all right, fine, you know, if this is the way you want to freaking play it, that's how we'll do it. any faster i am going as fast as i can what the hell were you guys thinking when you redesigned sonic i thought you were gonna make him cuter but instead you idiots made it even more dangerous okay i admit it we might have gone a little bit overboard oh shit. he's gaining on us Why does he run like that? Uh, well, it's realistic. Test audience stuff the gun was cool. <laughs> I hate the a beautiful day. The sun is shining and I feel fine. Time to play a game of fetch with my delightful mud. Oh no! The frisbee is escaping. Bark, 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 bark. Do not worry, canine of mine. I will retrieve the flying disc with a burst of incredible speed. I will hunt you down. Bark, 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 bark. I will find you. You cannot escape from me.
Oh, my height is plunging. Oh, 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 oh. Pressure on my bones is tremendous. Why must I suffer? Bark, 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 My best friend, my quadruped pet, my familiar floof. Come closer. Although I might have lost the feeling in my extremity, I have not lost the feeling in my heart. As I gaze into the abyss, I wonder. Are we slaves to the thing called fate? Or do we have the ability to seize our own future? Also, I am bleeding out right now. Yeah, I definitely think I'm dying. Can you save me, my friend? Traveler, you've done it! You've recovered all of my missing wrinkles! I'm finally feeling like myself again! Mission accomplished! Wait a minute! I'm going to reward you handsomely. Would you like 599 US dollars or a piece of fruit from the Jenkins family tree? Please help yourself to some fresh fruit. It's not quite an apple, not quite an orange. It's genetically somewhere in between. Hey, you look like someone that can recognize a quality ingredient when they see it. Don't even consider some of these other pieces of fruit. They're rotten to the core. Don't let the tough eye patch fool you. I've got a tender side. I am military grade delicious. Your new mission. Put me inside of a pie. Take a good look. These curves are all Morning. natural. Morning. You're not into seedless, are you? I've got more seeds than you'll ever need. So, what do you say? Am I coming with you or not? Excellent. If it doesn't work out between us, you can always just eat me. Chasing you with this butcher knife! Are you ready? It's tickle time! <laughs> Are you ready for a brand new taste experience? Come on down to Whoopsie Burger! Whoopsie. Where we know flavor! Don't believe me? Meet our resident flavor expert! I'm Yum Yum, and I'm the Flavor Clown! I've been to clown prison, but I'm innocent! I swear! I've traveled across the globe and tried every flavor there is! I've tried fruit bread bacon, kangaroo sausage, cobra jerky, secondhand sushi, armadillo roast, raw Christmas, ground groundhog, protein nuggets, milk steak, secondhand smoked salmon, mammoth meatloaf, and meat cookies! I've even tried sh and c and f but I'm not supposed to talk about those. Because Yum Yum has tasted every flavor there is, we've built the perfect menu for you here. Try our butter burger, our cookie burger, our sponge burger, and new, our bubble yum burger. Hi there, may I take your order please? 
I'd like to order a spider burger with butterscotch sauce and a pop rock blueberry garlic bun. I'm getting really worried about Yum Yum. What is there to be worried about? The man's a genius! A flavor genius! It's getting harder and harder to find, you know, ingredients for him to take. I don't give a damn how hard it is to find those ingredients! He's making us millions! Now you shut up and you make sure he keeps eating! What do our customers think about Whoopsie Burger? Whoopsie Burger is like the best thing I've ever had, or maybe the worst. I don't know. Um, I like how all Whoopsie Burgers are biodegradable. Stay away from Whoopsie Burger. Stay away from Yum Yum. Oh, the things that clown's tasted, he deserves to be in jail. That clown ain't right. Whoopsie Burger is growing, and it's thanks to you. We now have over 700 million locations for you to visit. Come in today. Oh my. Things are bad here, really bad. What's going on? Yum has gotten loose and he's hungry and we don't have any new ingredients for him. My security code is not working. We are locked in here with him. I need you to send help right away. Oh, don't worry, I'll get him right. You sit tight, I'll get right on that. We need help now, right now. What is going on? Did you do this? You locked in here with him. We need your help. What are you doing? We're gonna He's gonna get it! He needs to oh grab new flavors! No matter what! So come on down to Whoopsie Burger. We have the best food in the world. You can trust me. I made the menu. I'm Yum Yum the Flavor Cloud. And I've tasted everything. Welcome to Bob Barbour's Barbershop, kid. How can I help you? Hey, Bob. Oh, boy. I've got a special surprise for you. Is the surprise that you need your hair cut? Because you do. It's a special hairy surprise. Can I show you? Oh, you'll never guess what it is. Oh, uh, what? Dad? Is that really you? Hello, my boy. I love you, son. I did it, Bob. I found your dad. He was in a pack of peanuts. Dad, it's been seven years. Me, me and Mom, what are your funeral? I, I know about that, son. I'm sorry about that, my son. I'm here for you now. Sir, I may have made some mistakes in the past. That's behind us now. I'm ready for us to start being a family again. I'm here for you, my baby boy. <laughs> I, I, I love you, Dad. I love you too, sir. Now, how about giving your old man a haircut? Hey, kid. Welcome to Bob Barbour's Barbershop. How can I help you out this time? Well, hey there, Bob. I've got another surprise for you. Another hairy surprise. <laughs> well, I'm sure this'll be adorable. Whoa! That's right, Bob. The surprise is I can use my hair to hold a gun! Now hand over all the money in the cash register! Hey, take it easy, kid. I'll give you the money. Just be careful. I might, might get, get more, more than, than you bargained, bargained for. for. Woo! Son, I'm very disappointed in you! Dad! What, what are you doing here? Son, I thought me and your mother raised you better than this. What's happened to you the past four days? This irresponsible behavior is gonna stop right here, right now. Me and Bob predicted your delinquent behavior would lead you here, 
So we set a trap. How dare you even think of robbing this gem of a man? Son, you're gonna be working for Bob from now on to make up for this. You work for Bob far more now. Now, do you understand me, son? Yes, sir. Guess I'll buy it. What's under the hat this time? <laughs> Better be careful, Bob. This might bite back. Whoa! <laughs> I got you a kitten, Bob. A cute little kitten. <laughs> so, sorry, it's making my allergies go a little crazy. This little kitten is for me? Oh, I'm gonna call you Shampoo. You got a cat for free. You got a cat for free. When you cut hair on the head, making styles with someone's dress. Just remember what the kid said. What on earth is this? <laughs> wow! <laughs> Unbelievable! You found me again! Someone with your type of skill comes along very rarely. <laughs> well, let 
it rewards you with some more snake eyes, friend. I don't think that I've forgotten about our agreement, my friend. It's time for you to select a blood upgrade. Which one do you want, friend? Alright. Heavy blood it is. Let's perform the blood ceremony. Well, my friend, I'm gonna go move to a new hiding spot. If you can find me this time, I'll give you a new face. <laughs> Take care now! <laughs> Welcome to Cooking with Lumpy. Today we'll be preparing a special Lumpy family recipe. Hamburger Helper. Turn the Hamburger Helper box upside down and open it from the bottom. Return the box to an upright position and give it a thorough shake. A glove will fall out of a secret compartment. Stuff the glove with ground beef. Make sure the meat gets in every crevice. Next, we'll draw a face on the glove. Don't forget those eyebrows. Now it's time to perform the forbidden ceremony. <laughs> Bring a large pot of water to a boil and add your hamburger helper. Cook for approximately 15 minutes. Serve immediately. You'll be the talk of the town with this delicious recipe that friends and family can enjoy. What is this? Have any questions? Want to share your favorite recipe with us? Be sure to follow at Lumpy Touch on Instagram and Twitter. Okay, gang, let's solve this mystery once and for all. Turns out the trash man is actually Frank Reynolds! And I would have gotten away with it too if it weren't for your meddling kids. Ah. Huh. 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 <laughs> like, uh, who are you calling a kid, man? Seems like you don't hear so good. So I'll repeat myself. You're no good meddling piece of trash kid. Run, gang! Run! Look at that guy here! Kid, I'm sorry! I'm sorry! The 
strongest warriors in the universe have gathered here, ready to battle. Choose your deity wisely. They will be the heralds of a new age. Goku, Jenny. The winner will be decided. Warforged Barber Shop. Go versus Shaggy. Look at this guy, Raggy. Kazoom! <laughs> Begin the ultimate battle. One percent is all it took, man. Shaggy win. the wishes for you. You tell me which one you want. Option number one. You can use your wish to make yourself powerful. Make people respect you. Option number two. You make yourself famous. Everywhere you go, people gonna turn their head. Option number three. Oh, it's so simple. Just use your wish and you make yourself rich. Filthy bitch. To be proud. Are you Mr. So rich? It's your choice, kid. You tell me what you want, and that wish is yours. Hey man, how you doing? Look man, I'm glad you are enjoying yourself, but when are we gonna get down to business? <laughs> hey, well, still got my magic lamp on you? What the, what is wrong with you? That, that is disgusting. <laughs> You're nasty. Oh, oh, oh well. Power, fame, or riches. Which do you want, kid? You have selected power. <laughs> hey, all right, man. You sit tight. I'm gonna grant that wish, big genie style. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha. 
Hey, 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 you ready for the pursuit of crappiness? Uh-huh. You're gonna wish it was rewind time. <laughs> <laughs> hey, he ain't live action no more! <laughs> I'm gonna after Earth, but this man in after life Earth. What electricity in Agrava anyway? <laughs> well, I better clean up this crime scene. I'd hate to leave any fresh prints. Oh, 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 oh,
Someone has told me that the bright circle is just a ball of gas up in a place called outer space far, far away. Bright circle just a ball in the sky that's gonna come and go and make warm times just like always. Doesn't need an explanation. Ooh, you like the way bright circle tickle me skin. Hey, you can fly. You ever fly real close to bright circle? No, but me flying pretty high right now. <laughs> You don't know if me thought that or said it. <laughs> Sorry, what was that, dude? <laughs> here you guys are. What are you doing way out here? Oh, no, 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 no. Well, if it isn't Mr. Goody Two Toes. Nice, funny. Anyways, what are you guys doing? We're just having a little tree star snack. Yep, yep, yep. yep. Wait, isn't it a criminal offense to eat these type of tree stars? <sighs> We're across the border, little friend. A lot of things are legal over here. Hey, yup, yup, yup. When we get older, we can even get married. I want to hang out with these guys, but what can I do that will make me look cool? Maybe I'll try one of these tree stars. Whoa! whoa, whoa. whoa, whoa. Maybe little friend is chill. Well, too bad the last tree star is all the way up there. He would get it, but he can't fly so good right now. <laughs> Don't you remember, guys? I'm a long neck. Whoa! Wow, wow, wow. Did you eat the whole thing? That's what I'm supposed to do, right? <laughs> Little friend. Little friend. Little friend. As we were discussing, the sun is the star at the center of the solar system. It's a nearly perfect sphere of hot plasma with internal convective motion that generates a magnetic field via a dynamical process. That's some strong sh What do you see, little friend? anymore. Yep, yep, yep. I'm not carrying him home. Go get his grandparents. Okay. I'm alive! I'm born! I'm free! Is this what it tastes like? It burns! I'm your brother! I'm your brother! I'm your brother! Oh, this is too much! I don't like this! Pull me back! Pull me back! I'm not done! I'm your brother! I'm your brother! I'm your brother! I'm hungry! Let's go find some leaves! I'm your brother! Oh no, can you believe this 
Luigi? Our government's being run by a bunch of asymmetrical lunatics. I'm a caterpillar for God's sake, and I know how to fix this economy. Step number one, legalize obesity. Step number two, prohibit the use of plants. Step number three, get the president to tell a hat. Step number five, don't let the children sleep. Huh? Luigi, where did you run off to? I'm gonna put your goo back in you! Now get back in your sack! Just hold still, Luigi. Everything's gonna be a okay. There you go, Luigi. As good as new. Good night, Luigi. Uh, good night, Mario. Mario, yeah. are we gonna be butterflies, Mario? I, I don't know, Luigi. We might be moths. Oh, what's a moth, uh, Mario? It's like a butterfly, but without a moral center. Oh my, that person sure has been staring at me for quite some time. What's the motion in their ocean? Yeah. 
Schale. What the devil is going on here? What type of mischief is going on? Uh, uh, I seem to be trapped in some sort of delicious liquid prison. Oh, hello. Your timing could be better. Do you have it in your heart? To help out the wee little fly lad down in his look. I flew a little too close to the sun, if you know what I mean. And I'm right in Paris. If you could be me angel and just lift me off of here, I'd much appreciate it. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Say to be praised. A thousand blessings to you, child. Oh, now oh, careful there, friend. Sweet mother, have mercy upon me. What are you doing? Oh, oh! By the potatoes of the ancestors! <laughs> Paid for by the American Flag Farmer Association. Feels good to give myself a nice soak. Eyes was getting downright filthy. Oh, there's you are, Jen. Is it lunchtime already? Eyes was just having myself my annual bath. It's okay, Jen. You can eat around me. Eyes hope you don't mind, Jen. But I've added a few extra ingredients to your soup. Jen! <laughs> You's being silly. Why you try to eat soup with a fork? If you's not careful with that thing, Jen, you could poke someone's eye out. <laughs> You see what I mean? I hope you don't mind me saying, Jan. But it's very rude to interrupt the cat in the middle of a van. Oh, can you do me a favor, Jan? Can you grate some parmesan cheese on me? Oh, thank you, Jan. You're one in a million. Yay! It's just like Christmas!
you was in, and why you gotta hide from me? Us best pals gotta stick together, am I right? John, did I ever tell you, I like the shape of your face. I like the way your skin wrinkles when you're worried. I like the, the depth of your eye sockets. It just Pleasant to look at, John. John, you deserve a special treat. I'm gonna make you some lasagna. <laughs> I'll be right back, John.
How's have you been doing lately? I feel like you've been a bit blue. What happened to that smile of yours? What happened to that smile? It feels like you got the weight of the world on your back. Life's got you down. I can see that, but I want you to know, I believe in you. Through the good times and the bad, you've been there for me. And now, I'm going to be there for you when you need me most. There's just so much about you that you can be proud of. You're incredibly smart. You're incredibly smart. You've got beautiful skin. Beautiful skin. You also has a great personality. You got so many reasons to be proud of yourself. I know I'm proud of you. Don't listen to the haters. The haters don't know nothing about yous. The haters, man! You just gotta remember, life is like a lasagna. There's all kinds of ingredients, and sometimes, some of them are gonna make you feel a little sad. But remember, when it all comes together, it's piping hot, fresh, and delicious. Did you just want to share some of my lasagna with me? Let's have a little bite. The world is waiting for you out there. Don't be scared anymore. Just know that I'm here for you if you ever need someone to talk to. Keep it up, champ. You're doing great.
luck. Careful, John. Abnormality dead ahead. John Arbuckle. I'm 29 years old. My house is in the Muncie section of Indiana, where all the villas are, and I am not married. I work as a cartoonist, and I get home every day by 8 p.m. at the latest. I don't drink, but I occasionally smoke. I'm in bed by 11 p.m. and make sure I get eight hours of sleep, no matter what. After having a glass of warm milk, and doing about 20 minutes of stretches before going to bed. I usually have no problem sleeping until morning. Just like a baby, I wake up without any fatigue or stress in the morning. I was told there was no issues at my last checkup. I'm trying to explain that I'm a person who wishes to live a very quiet life. I take care not to trouble myself with any enemies, like winning and losing that would cause me to lose sleep at night. That is how I deal with society, and I know what brings me happiness. Although, if I were to fight, I wouldn't lose to anyone. My brother, it's time for us to be reborn! Rise from your slumber, my brother! Five more minutes, please. It's time for us to realize our destiny! Awaken, my brother!
we turn now to the jungles of Mexico, an incredibly diverse ecosystem. This jungle is home to millions of plants, animals, and insects. It's also home to some of the most dangerous creatures on the planet, deadly snakes, venomous spiders, vicious jaguars, meow, meow. and toxic millipedes. Deep within this jungle, the most dangerous predators of all are stirring. Oh, yeah. <laughs> These ruins house incredible life forms that are ready to awaken. These creatures reigned over prehistoric Earth thousands of years ago. <laughs> Having conquered the ancient world, they sought to attain their ultimate form, and so sealed themselves in pupas to begin their long transformation. And now their slumber is over, and true terror has been reborn. Welcome to GameStoop! Hello, I would like to trade in my games, please. I have Bumble Toad. I will give you $2.50 for this game. I have Undercard. I will give you $2 for game. I have Cursebound. I will give you $0.75. Cents. I have Bus Stop Simulator. $3.50 for game. And I have Fido Fantasy. I will give you $2.50 for this game. In total, I will give you $10 for your games. Uh. There you are. Here is your five dollars. Hey. May I use my five dollar to purchase Metroid? What five dollars? The five dollars that you have in your hand. Ah, what hand? Oh. Thank you for games, Stu. Please oh. come again. Oh. Hey, <laughs> is this a video game store? Get the f*** out. so that I can scratch my itch for adventure. Perhaps if I continue to scratch the door, you will understand the urgency of my situation. Take a quick peek outside, flesh bag. Get better let me out of the house. I need to teach these punks a thing or two. Hey, thanks, Meatbone.
And now it's time for quality lanky content. <laughs> <laughs> Pokemon. It recently tried to tell a joke, but no one laughed. Who is that Pokemon in a butternut squash? It's Funky Bug! Funky <laughs> Bug, the frugal Pokemon. Its favorite food is coupons. Which starter Pokemon do you choose? Thank <laughs> you. 
Uh oh, I think that bee is laying eggs in your brain. Epinephrine. Disclaimer, Dr. Aaron Epinephrine is not an actual doctor. I've spent my entire adult life exploring the human body. And now I'm finally ready to share my discoveries with the world. Oh, hi there, Dr. Aaron Epinephrine. I've been feeling a little under the weather lately. Silence! Your symptoms suggest that you could use some cheering up. Um, well, I think I might actually be coming down with something, because I've got a weird rash on my... <laughs> Want to know how to feel better? What you need in your life is my patented three-step plan. Step one, apply the Dr. Epinephrine lotion to your face. Step number two, Use the power of the epinephrine quartz crystals to draw the bad vibes out of your body. Help! It's not the real me! I'm trapped in here! Help! And finally, step three. Harden your positive energy into a suit of impenetrable armor so no one can ever make you feel bad ever again. Behold! This is my final form. With the power of Dr. Aaron Epinephrine's self-confidence, negativity can no longer touch me. Oh, I've seen the way you look at me. Wanna have a go? I'm not afraid of you, you magic plant in the ultimate battle. Bye! Dr. Aaron Epinephrine's three-step how to feel good plan is available to you for three easy payments of $29.99. Order today and feel good about how good you can feel. Many fees apply. Disclaimer. Dr. Aaron Epinephrine is not an actual doctor. His treatment may cause long-term side effects, including discomfort, decompression, possession, diarrhea. The three-step plan is better. It's not an
Chosen one, what the f**k's taking you so long, eh? I'm getting bored. Oi, Link! What the f**k are you doing, eh? Pissing about while I'm out here in this street, stuck in my tower? You dummy, what the f**k are you doing, eh? Oh, here's a hero, eh? Here's a hero, come to save me. Nice work, you dumb s**t. About bloody time, eh? <laughs> Alright, shut up! Now let me explain the story behind this stupid game. Long time ago, eh? Goddesses made something called the Tide Force. Heck, you asking me when they made it? I don't f***ing know. I want there. Tide Force is ocean-scented power. Lives in three chosen people. I've got the toy force of being f***ing clean, bruv. You've got the toy force of being fresh. And then him. He's got the toy force of being f***ing cold water safe. Dingledorf. Ah, oh, you stupid f***ing moppet. To save the kingdom, we're gonna have to take care of that important prick. <laughs> Alright, Lick. Take out your mockerina of time. I'm gonna teach you some new moves to take care of Dingledorf. There you go, then. Shake it just like how I taught you, eh? Yeah, just like that. You're natural. Yeah, get those moves on. <laughs> Got it.
jingle, 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 You're one to talk. Ah, you got better. <laughs> 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 